This is your first ever ride on the bike. I know. Right. We need okay. To stuff, don't we? Well, I did. I'm covering my front brake here. I'm just like I, I want to adjust that mirror, so I'm thinking I must need to cover my back brake so I can just do that so I'm not rolling anywhere all right then back on my front brake and I can take my foot down now, if ever you've got your options here if you've ever you've got your hams tied up and your engine's not running hmm. and you don't want your bike to roll away yeah you can put it in gear because it won't roll backwards it oh yeah forward, you know yeah so you covered that point and um, that's just an option for you you've got generally You've got your foot or your hand, but if you want to put yeah. both feet on the ground and use both hands, yeah, just make sure it's in gear first. Yeah, simple. All right. Um, what we need to do is just discuss the smoothness of your clutch while we're sat here, um, and also, I, I, there's a good. I, I heard somebody else say this as well. Everything like a dimmer switch. When you're using your accelerator, yeah. it's nice and slow and back yeah. and, forth, slow and forth. Trust me, I ain't going anywhere fast right now. No, exactly right. And it's the same with your clutch, letting it in and out. Right. Now, of course, it's the same situation. You've got to remember your gears, which were what? Do you remember? Um, well, I'm in neutral now, so down for one, and then up, up, up. Yeah, up to fifth. Yeah. And then back down, fourth, third, second, mm. neutral, first. Yeah. When you're coming to a stop, you can come down the gears nice and steadily. You're listening, trying to match the revs and slowly. But you, at the moment, I'm really thinking... First gear. <laughs> well, actually... <laughs> yeah. No, I, I, come on, give me a chance. Yeah. First gear, <laughs> and literally, I want you just to go set off and then come to a stop again. Yeah. That's all we're looking at doing at the moment. Yeah. Because I want you to set off. And because you're going uphill... Yeah. You don't even have to touch the brakes because you're only going to get up to, up to maybe five or six k's an hour. Right and then you can pull the clutch back in and it'll just slowly come to a stop again. Okay. All you've got to do is remember to put your feet down. This is your first ever ride on the bike. I know. Now, start it up. Get it off the side stand. Before I start it? Yeah. You sat on it now, you can put the side stand away. Okay. You're in charge of the bike. Yeah. Any bike, any size bike that you ever have and ever ride. Yeah. You're the boss. Yeah. All right, there's no bike in charge of you. Completely in charge. You don't right. you're 50 kilos, 150 kilos, or your bike's 300 kilos, you're the boss. So you're neutral, get your ignition on. So do I need to pull the clutch in first or not? Not yet, you need your ignition on. So, but if I take my hand off, I, so I need to yeah. so back brake. Yeah. All right, okay. Okay. And then I can. Yeah, so you click, you're in neutral. Right. Which you were already way yep. off. Okay. Yep. At that point, you can actually start it up. Yeah. Because you're covering the back brake. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Should you always trust the neutral indicator? No. no. You told me not. Because sometimes the electronics can go a bit. The, the look, it, it's not Italian. There are far better electronics than 1970s and 80s Ducatis, where you might get a false neutral showing. Mm hmm. And at this point, if it was in gear and you tried starting it without your clutch, right? Because. But what, shall I pull my clutch in then, just uh, in case? Absolutely. All right. Yes. Okay. And you've got your ignitions on. You've got your lights here. You've got your neutral light. Mm -hmm. You've got your starter button here, yep. which is your grey one. Your engine killer is not on, so it's ready to run. So give it a press, and that's all you need to do. She's warmed up. There's no fueling issues now because it's warmed up you know like as we said we had the choke on the other day it's got that little British Leyland choke thing that you pull out to start it up don't need it anymore it's all warmed up now you've got your neutral your in gear let's go through that procedure in relation to selecting gears so swap over to your right foot we're covering your foot. I have a but yeah so I'll take my oh, yeah I've, yeah and I'm covering that brake so then I engage the gear swap back your back brake and then you've got your you can let that off now so now you've got control over the bike moving that was forward for your back brake you've got your left foot on the ground and you're covering the back brake so you have got your left foot on the ground you've got your gear at this point now you'd be in a situation where 
you don't even have to start giving it any throttle until you get a little bit of get to your friction point. So get to the bite. Hmm? Get, get to the bite. So you get a little bit of bite. You, you can, without, we don't have to go yet, what we're talking about here is just finding your friction point. Nice and steady. You'll I've got, so I've still got the back brake on, yeah? Yes, you'll hear the engine. Keep going. There, did you hear the Yeah, ride? yeah. Now go back again. So that's when, you might want to, when you hear that little you see, you heard the, the bike, yeah. you heard it. So that's when you'll give it a little bit of throttle. Now keep your clutch in at the moment. Give the bike a rev, get a feeling for the... It's like a little, it's like a little sewing machine, it's beautiful. And it's just gorgeous. So what you want to do, is find that biting point. Look at your face, you're dead excited. <laughs> and nervous. And nervous, I have to say I'm nervous and excited. You've got to be. But it's great, and you're only going to go 10 or 15 metres, right? So, put your brake. Use it, get your, start that little friction point and as you get to it, give it a slight bit of throttle you're going, that's enough, just a bit more let your clutch out let your clutch out, let your clutch out and give it a bit more throttle My, my you're brain's. Tense. You're tense. I am tense, and my brain was no, no. trying to. You're gonna be tense. You're gonna be gripping yeah. with fear. Big breaths. <laughs> I don't want to change gear yet. I just want to get used to starting and stopping. Well, this is a great environment to do it. Yeah. Um, let me just block the car. It's like everybody's gonna break into it. We're in the middle of nowhere. But look, big breaths. This is all you need to be doing. Yeah. I'm not gonna tell you I've got a second gear. Nah. I want you to get used to that, go and stop it. Yeah. Getting used to, because what will happen is you'll eventually go, oh, I can do this back and forth. Yeah. So let's go again. Okay. Remember, just get your feet up. When you're coming to a stop, you did it right, put your feet back down. But you're only going to first gear at the moment. And just yeah. do that. I want you to do that a dozen times. And you go through the right, like, don't worry about them leaves. Nah. Like, straight through them if you need to. Mm. Go through them. Whatever you want, start and stop. Just keep practicing that. Find your find your throttle, and then let your gear out. Let, let your clutch out. in your clutch a little bit, bring it in and out a little bit, and make it smooth, get the power of the, you'll feel the smoothness by feathering your clutch a little bit. Okay now, go a little bit quicker, give it a bit of throttle. Neutral. focused and concentrating quite hard actually but I'm relaxing a little bit more feels a lot easier now and like yeah it was good feathering my, the clutch that that helps actually yeah yeah that's good actually that's making a massive difference I end up back in my law at this rate Heavy, 
heavy. Whew, that was heavy. <laughs> uh, up. No, what's that? There you go. <laughs> I was almost going to drop it then. Here she comes. Mrs. Ryder guy that's doing her first little fun and games on a little private track we've found. And uh, it's fun, it's great, she's loving it. She's, she's setting off now. So let's get a video of her coming in. She's a bloody natural, of course. She'll have a grin from ear to ear. Oh, she stood up. <laughs> She's an adventure riding girl. Did you see that? I can't get my breath. She's been watching too many videos. She's gone. Oh, she better not go too far. I've got to chase her again. The car's gone past the car. Oh no, she's good. Top, top job. You've got, you've found a gear, haven't you, as well? You were. Stood up. Did you see that? It's on video. <laughs> I'm going. Look, she stood up. She's been watching, probably watching. Uh, um, you and McGregor. You and you and Charlie. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Brilliant. Give us a thumbs up, Mrs. Mrs. Rider Guider. Happy? Yeah, delighted. Okay.